Hi again YouTube, this is part one of maybe two or three parts of an elf haul. Probably not going to swatch everything, so just bear with me. So um, I placed my order about, I'd say eight days ago. This one took a lot longer than the last. They processed my order for like three or four days, but it's here. So it came in a pretty decent size box and in the traditional elf bag. And I'm going to start with some stuff that I actually got from Target rather than on elf.com. Okay. And I'm out of breath because we were just outside cutting down the tree that fell from the storm. So that's why. So I got the Elf Beauty Book Smoky Eyes Edition. And the thing that I love about this palette is it's $4.99. Obviously there's more than five shadows in here. So that's a deal already. Because even the... You know, the one dollar eyeshadows are going to be a dollar. So, love it. And the thing that I really love is look how big these are. And I just dropped the pencil. Hold on. Okay. And the applicator. <laughs> Got it. And it comes with your traditional applicator. They are a little better quality than most applicators you get. Like, for example, the quad sets come with this, which is pretty janky. But this one's actually pretty sturdy. I don't think I'll be using it, but it's decent. It's going to come with the brightening eyeliner in black. Of course, just a short little one. But it's still pretty, pretty pigmented, and it does the job. It does the job. So, again, I'll hold that down. You can see these are huge. And you can see all the different smoky colors. So you're not limited to just like a gray and black. And you can see that some have shimmer and some are matte. And I know you can see my fingerprints in there. I'm not going to swatch all those or we'll be here all day. But check it out. Target, elf.com, eyeslipface.com, whatever. Awesome, awesome. The next item is something I'm pretty sure I may have showed you, at least in my makeup collection video. But I'm going to re-show it as an in my haul because I, like I said, I lost track of what I had and hadn't shown. And this is the 32 palette, and I believe it's in, like, neutrals or everyday basics. And I do want to get the rest of these because I love them. So you see here, again, you got some satin finishes, silky finishes. This one right here is freaking phenomenal. Look at that. It's gorgeous. It excites me. And again, you can see my fingerprint, and you can see that I use it. So you got lots of neutral colors, but then you also have, like, some funky err, like this blue here. I don't know how well it picks up on the camera, but it's like a light, 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 funky blue. But the satin finish is awesome. But some of those can be a little chalky. $4.99. I got that one at Target, but you can get it online. Let me see what else did I get from Target. Some of the stuff is iffy. So, um, I might be lying on accident if I say I got it from Target or I didn't get it from Target. But I'm pretty sure that this stuff I got from Target. Um... This one I definitely got from Target. I could have been more organized. But, what are you going to do, right? Okay, so I decided I would try their Tone Correcting Concealer. And I know a lot of people say that they hate the smell. Me, personally, I think it smells awesome. I love it. So, it's kind of like oranges. And I'm in light beige. And I'll show you here on my finger where I burnt myself with my curling iron. You can see here. And that's my dog barking at nothing. So it works pretty well. And it smells awesome. Like I said, love it. A dollar. And I'm not usually one to buy cheap mascara. Not at all. But I decided I would give it a go. Because it was a dollar and I heard a few people like it. And this is a duo. And I did not get it in black. I got it in black brown. Because I didn't want it to be too harsh. And let's see. This end is the waterproof. So it's just a little tube. And again, you're not going to get a ton of product, but who needs, you don't go through that much mascara anyway. And then on this end is the regular. A dollar. <sighs> Let's see. I ran out of my lash stiletto liner. I think it's called line stiletto. So I decided I would try the e.l.f. Now, it's really dark black, which I like. I like the applicator because it's pretty much a hard stick end. So it really doesn't bend and you can kind of guide it along. But... It is so watery, and you can see the shine that I would imagine I've not actually used it on my eyes yet. It's going to take a minute to dry. When you blink, 
you're in trouble. But it was a dollar. So that moves on to this. And I've got them in coffee and I've got them in black. Both of them a dollar. And they are the e.l.f. waterproof eyeliner pens. And when I initially tried these, like I said in my other video, I didn't like them after I lined my first eye because then I felt like it felt like dried out. But I figured out if you just shake them a lot, they really do a lot better. So this one here is the black. And you can see it comes on and it is dry. And it does flow on pretty well. And I'm pretty sure they're fairly waterproof and smudge proof because I can tell you that the other day I did a lot of yard work and I had it on my hand and it still did not come off. And here's coffee, which isn't as light as I would have liked, but I guess it's still lighter than the black, which I like. A dollar. I got the Elf Zit Zapper. And it's basically just like silicic acid, I think they say. And it smells terrible. But it does give a nice tingle when you put it on. It comes with a little roller ball. And for a dollar, let me tell you something. That sucker is full. And I've already used it like four or five times. And that's all I've used. So that's a lot for a dollar. Then I heard that the Super Glossy Lip Shine in Goddess was really popular. In fact, it was the most popular one. So this was the last one at Target. So I picked it up. And I love the way that these smell. They're awesome. This one smells so good. And it's really pretty. It's really good for everyday wear. And they do come out like they're sticky. But when they're on, they're sticky. Don't get me wrong because it's a lip gloss. But it's not nearly as sticky as a lot of the ones you'll find. And you'll see that's really nice on top of something or just by itself. Another thing I got is the e.l.f. Shimmering Facial Whip. I've heard a lot of bad things about these and a lot of good things. Again, the smell, I like it. And I got it in, I think it's, it's Spotlight, which is the most gorgeous highlight color ever. And you can use it for other things. But... I love it. And I don't think this is going to pick up too well. Yeah, there we go. It's so nice and natural. It's just like a sheen. But when the light hits it, it's awesome. And you could wear that as a base under your eyeshadow even. My hair's a mess. Sorry. Again, cutting down a tree all day will do that. Okay, so I think, I think, I think, I think that might be almost all that I got from Target in the store. I believe I bought this in the store. And it's Cherry Tart, the Luscious Liquid Lipstick. You can see that color there. It looks super pigmented. It's not. Again, it's a completely different smell, but awesome. And then I'm going to... And you do have to twist and twist and twist these initially to get them to come all the way up. But this is another one where you can just layer on the color. So here you see the light side, and then you, hear where I, you can see where I put like two layers of it. And it gets pretty good there. And I'm going to show you this. I got this with my first e.l.f. order. And that was online. It's the Hyper Shine Gloss. And it's in Vixen. Okay. I like it. Again, a completely different smell. But I'm going to show you something. It, if you want a lot more pigment, go ahead with the Cherry Chart the Luscious Liquid Lipstick. If you want more just a sheer but with color but lighter go with this, the Hyper Shine Gloss, because they're damn near the same color, just one's a lot more uh, vibrant than the other. So if you're kind of shy with bright colors, you might want to do that one. And if you really like the bright colors, I would go with the Luscious Liquid Lipstick all the way, okay? That one's probably my best bet. Putting stuff back here, I got it. Okay. I'm trying to think, trying to think, trying to think. Okay. I think this is the last item that I got in the store and it's the mattifying powder and it's translucent and this was three dollars comes with a little rubber sponge like this and it literally is a translucent powder super smooth and this I love it is perfect for just blotting onto the skin and carrying it in the purse to take away that oil during the day so I will definitely be repurchasing that. So I'm super excited about it. So I'm going to stop here before I run out of time. And I will continue in part two of my elf haul. Thanks.